seventh, eighth, twice a week. Disadvantage, and I don't know how we got here, but uh, we're here. But the points that the team had uh, as well, that they were the well, we blew a couple leads. I think we learned from that. I think that's the ebony ivory flow of uh, a series. You don't win, a, I think I told some of my teammates, you don't win a series off a of game three or off a of game four. Nobody wins a series, especially a game seven, oh, best of seven in game four. So we could just learn from it. We went back to the drawing board. We kept our head down. We stayed humble and uh, we manifested some uh, executions. We tried to manifest some executions and uh, plays, and it worked. Coach was a genius. What well, is from the winning that Oh, yeah, I'm so happy for him. I think uh, I think you guys, everybody knows about his story with Top and Tech. So just uh, just me being like a an older guy, always for him, always cheering for him, always giving him. All the, you know, made up your and it's so it's, it's even for me it's overwhelming that he won this. He played a great series. He played a great series. Uh, all my teammates played great. Pero just for him with the backstory, uh, I think you guys know. I think I read a couple, a lot of articles that you guys wrote about him, and about what happened and what transpired, and just. I'm looking forward to waking up tomorrow with a lot of positive, uh, positive write-ups for Terrence Strong for you. the next couple of days, for next week, until we forget about it. I don't know if I'm going to feel like that. You've been bonding with Terrence, uh, in practice with your, your three-point shooting competitions. Uh, how much, uh, in your view, how much has this, how much has this, how much has grown since coming over to your team from that point up to now? How much has he grown? Uh, grown and matured from that point on. I think when you get finals experience, when you get to the finals and you win championships, uh, the maturity level just goes a little higher. It's not necessarily us, or it's not necessarily me or anybody else that's making him mature. I think it's just being in the series, being in the last, the last two teams standing, uh, last conference. You know, that definitely adds to the maturity, that expedites the maturity, especially now. So. Uh, I don't, I don't want to take any credit. I don't want to take any credit for it, none of that. I don't think any of my teammates should, but he did it. I'm proud of him. I'm very, very proud of him. Alex, um, won the second championship and the position to win the next one. you like the chances? I'm not thinking about that now. I think, uh, I think the Grand Slam is pitted on us, but it's so difficult. I think it's convenient to say. We'll, we'll address that when we cross the bridge. Right now, it's just enjoy it. I think it's going to take away from the championship we won. If we talk about Grand Slam, I think it's premature. I think it's premature. I think it's premature to put that on us. We won today uh, for the Governor's Cup. Uh, I think the task that we did this last three months, it shouldn't be overshadowed with uh, you know, just logistically thinking about the Grand Slam. It's in the back of our minds, but as of right now, there's so much going on right now that we should just uh, be thankful, stay humble, stay down to earth, and just uh, thank God for all the, all the blessings He gave us tonight. Thank you so much. Palcast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.